Welcome, my loves. Welcome to another daily pick a card. This is Anna, the Star Priestess Tarot. It's called this channel. I am a very sensitive channeler. I consider myself more a natural medium healer and psychic, of course. And, and I love to use Tarot, absolutely. So let's do a new pick a card, and this time about your future spouse. What is important for them that it's in you? Okay, this is something that it's very important that they're going to try to find in you. Take the messages as it, as it resonates, as this is a general reading. This time I'm not showing the messages down below the cards, but you have this beautiful image, group number one with red, the red color, group number two with the green one, and group number three, we have the pink one. I reminded that I am doing private readings and sessions, well, sessions, yes, channeling plus tarot through camp, through my shop, selling some crystals through my shop and if you want something more, more economical and more specific and not use not spending a lot of money you have the links down below of keen and purple garden my angels are going to leave you to connect with your groups and of course if you like the way i work don't forget to subscribe thank you for the comments and thank you for the likes guys i will see you in just a few moments Number one, very beautiful color red reminds me of the root chakra and also reminds me of YouTube <laughs> because of the logo. <laughs> Whenever I see red, I don't know if it's because I'm obsessed some years here working in YouTube in this amazing platform, but yes, I think that your person is highly creative and had been ha I think that your person has some issues concerning the root chakra. I don't know if that's your case as well. Now let's see the mystery message coming out with this card and it says shield of crystals i am loved and protected so we already can see that what it seems important with number 25 what it seems important for your future spouse to find in you is that somebody that is warm right and somebody that it's protected protective because I think that your future spouse is not used to that in the past, okay? I think that they're taking care a lot of, about their appearance, okay? They are feeling, they struggle with their appearance. And it's, it's interesting because I am listening from spirit that they're so beautiful, you know? But they, they, yes, they are struggling with their physical appearance. And I think they have all of those insecurities. Wow, look at that. I did not realize I had this this one in this deck. Look at that. Change the perspective. Sorry, change the perspective for observation. Yes. Again, the way they see themselves is some they're sometimes not being fair with them. And I, I really think it's because they struggle with I don't know if they pass through bullying from some exes or from an ex or the last ex. I really think that your person is trying to change their perspective about, about themselves and about love. And maybe that's why you guys you did not meet before because they struggled a lot with, uh, with their self-esteem. Okay, let's put this here. And yes, we can see already that your, for your person it's very important to find in you warmth. You know, somebody that supports them, not somebody that treats them bad because I don't know. I really think that they had it. Maybe, I don't know if it has been one experience or several. You know, some people have not treated your future spouse very well in the past. And that's why they're struggling with the physical appearance, the way they look at themselves. I did not, and, oh my gosh, I did not realize I had another card from the other deck. Where is it? I don't know. Yes, I have this one as well. This is so crazy. It will still take a long time in June. Okay. 
So this came out from the other reading. I did not notice it was inside of this deck. So yes, I really think that both of you have the feeling and the sensation that this is taking too long to find one another. But June, June is important for all of you guys or most of you guys. June is a name as well. Okay, there's something going on with summertime. Okay. I take those um, those cards because there are never coincidences, right? I'm sorry, I'm moving the iPad. So, the cards that are coming out, my love. We have the Wheel of Fortune. Okay. I think that uh, it's important for them that you're very balanced, you know, that emotionally you're balanced, or at least that you try to regulate it. Maybe some of you, you think I'm not emotionally balanced, but are you trying to regulate it? I think that no one is perfectly balanced. Uh, we are here in this matrix, but you know what I mean? Three of cups, okay, so they want you to, they expect from you that you there's harmony in you, you know, you're going to bring them harmony, that you have nice friends, Okay, and again, I think that they did not experience that with an with an ex or several exes. Four of Pentacles. They will love you uh, to take again to take care of them. You see, the Four of Pentacles reminds me of the first message that I was channeling from Spirit and what I perceived with this card, what I read in this card. So this person wants you to to really protect them, not to make them feel like BS. You know, I think that they're coming from that in the past. Maybe some of you too, and you understand these messages because you leave that with an ex, and I'm so sorry, and with some excess. We have the Emperor, the Lover, Sun, the Knight of Wands, Sun, the Knight, uh, sorry, the Knight and the Nine of Wands, yes. So this person would like from you as well that sometimes you can say, you know, you can organize the dates, not only them, okay? Your person is waiting to have an incredible sex with you as well, an inc incredible intimacy. I suppose they want you to be like, you know, like or like in a good vibe. Um, I think that your person with the Nine of Wands expects you to understand them that they need a hug, they need healthy boundaries, you know, they need somebody that understands where they're coming from. And then playfulness, no? With the Emperor. Well, the Emperor, we know that it's like a natural leader, right? Again, I think that your person does not want always to organize all of the dates, if it makes sense, you know? Wants both of you to, one day you organize the date, another day they organize the date. It's like they want this to keep it balanced, you know? Maybe even they would like to pay half and half from time to time, not always. It could be. Some people are like that. Uh, and we have forgiveness and we have spirit soul path. Yes. So we have allow healing waters to wash away the pain of the past. Okay. So your person is expecting you to have overcome your excess okay that's something that it's in the mind and spirit soul path a personal evolution within your relationship so they're waiting for you to be very spiritual they're waiting for you to to be awakened and i think that if you're in this channel of course you are in youtube <laughs> no not in my channel And we have thinker and the tribe. Yes, I really think that your person is thinking a lot of, about you. They really want to find you and they want to make sure that both of you, you're from the same tribe. I think that these are your thoughts as well. I don't think this is just their thoughts. They keep thinking about you, keep thinking, 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 you know, where can I meet them? Where can I find them? Maybe some of you, you have already met and this makes sense. And they, they are constantly thinking about you. And you're watching each other many times during the week. But they keep constantly, you know, observer. Yes. 
I think that your person is somebody that likes to think a lot, you know, to have a lot of reflections. And you see, exchanging gifts. Yes, yeah, so I, this person wants you to be like, you know, like be open to receive and give. I th it's very important for them that there's a lot of balance, a lot of playfulness with the cat, the squirrel, okay? So they expect from you that you are fun. And that, again, that you're going to be warm. Warm. Being warm is important for them. Okay, my loves? Now let me add these ones. So we have foggy book, patience, yes. They want you to be patient. Okay, maybe the, the exes or that ex that harmed them was not very patient with them, okay? And that's something that they don't like. They don't want to be in defensive mode with you. And we have knowledge with air spirit, okay? I think that they believe you are from a different culture or country or you live in a different city or state or, yes, or country. That you live in a different place because they have tried, many of them, if, if some of you you have not met yet, they have tried many, many ways to meet you and they really believe that you are from somewhere else. One second, guys. I have the cards over here. And the last message. He seems very nice. She seems very nice. Yes, this Peter's boss seems very nice. A very, very good, good person. I think that they need somebody sensitive. They cannot be with someone that it's not warm. And we have gold digger, caution, and let go. You see, so they're used to people that, that use them, okay? Your future spouse is used to people that were only with them because of their money, you know? They want your money being, they want your money being used. Find out more information. Don't overwork yourself and make room for the new beginning on its way to you, to you now. You see, so your person has been healing. Because they went, they, they, maybe it has happened with several exes, but this is somebody, a very specific one, that they hurt them a lot. They felt used, you know, not taken care of. And they have been healing their heart. And I think that they are watching a lot of butterflies like you because this means that both of you, you have just met or you're very close to meet one another. So they... So if you're asking yourself, why did, have I not founded my future spouse yet? It's because they were healing from this past relationship that was very harmful for them. I think that you are going to marry a very beautiful soul like you. I'm so, I'm so happy for both of you guys. My angels, I hope you have liked it. If that's the case, please subscribe, leave a comment and like it. And uh, maybe if you want a reading from me, thank you so much. And if you want to give me a donation and at the same time receive more specific information, you can use Keen or Purple Garden. Mm, have an amazing day. Bye, my loves. Bye, my angels. Bye. Welcome, group number two. So let's see what it's really important for your future spouse. They are, they are wishing for you to have that, or at least it would be important for them if you had that. So we have... Very beautiful, the green color reminds me of the heart chakra and of nature, you know, like a very loving person. I think that this person falls in love. I don't know, well, I was going to say easily, I don't think it's easily, but they love to fall in love, okay? I'm listening from your future spouse. They miss that. And we have bubble power with number six. My wishes float easily out into the world. So funny because I was. Spirit works in such an amazing way. And in group number one, I had three cards of a different deck inside of this deck of Tarot. I did not realize. And one of the cards was June. And again, June coming out for you. So interesting. So my wishes float easily out into the world. Okay. So I could tell you already that your future spouse would love you to support them with their dreams. Okay, even now I'm listening from spirit, maybe some of you, you have already met this person, your future spouse, or maybe others, you're waiting for this connection. They, will, they would really love to do a project with you. Okay. They would really love to do a, to have a business with you or to 
create something together, not only being a couple and best, and best friends, but it's import important for them that you do not judge their dreams and that you could support them in the dreams, okay? In the dream, in the dreams, in the career, whatever they're trying to manifest or they're already working on. I was listening that your future spouse is a little bit like Elon Musk, like the next Elon Musk. I was listening that, okay. Yes, because I think that they did not have a lot of support from family. So, we have here the Imperial, right? This is somebody that has their own business or is trying to have their own business, your future spouse. And they would love you to be part of that business. And if that's not the case, because some of you, you don't want to work in the business, they would really want you to understand that it's important for them, the dreams, okay, the wishes. So they really think that they know what they're doing, of course, in their business. Sometimes I'm sure they don't, but they really truly feel in the heart with the nine of cups and the six of cups. This is something that they started. It started when they were a child or when they were very young. And this is something that it's very dearest for them. So yes, they would love you to really support them in their dreams. And as well, they would love you to be open to meet their family because I'm listening, they don't live in your area. They live somewhere else. So that would be amazing for your future spouse that both of you, you could get a flight, a, um, maybe a cruise for some of you. Maybe it could be a bus because it's in a different state. Uh, so you could meet their parents. This is important for them. This is somebody very romantic. They are also expecting from you that you like flowers, you like romantic gestures. I don't know, maybe some of you, you're not romantic, but I think that maybe you're going to be, um, be more open with your future spouse. And then we have the three of wands, you see? So your future spouse would love to expand with you, you know, that, that, that your love expands that even it could be that your future spouse would love to both of you to live in an area where you are really happy. I think that your person likes a lot living, well, I was listening in California for some of you, some of them, but living very close to the sea, okay? This is important for your future spouse to live very close to the sea. Maybe, maybe it makes them feel amazing, good, okay. We have the Wheel of Fortune that came out in group number one as well. So again, your future spouse will love you to support them with their dreams, okay? Because they feel that whatever they're doing already, because with Emperor, this is somebody that's a nat natural leader, somebody that is truly taking action, okay? So whatever they have started, they think that it's part of the destiny. It's coming from the past. They feel very connected to their ancestors, very romantic. And this is somebody that always wants to evolve. This is not someone that is not going to never, ever, ever travel. And is always only going to stay in their city. And is going to do the same for 25 years. No, and there's nothing wrong about that. Many people are happy like that, but this is not your future spouse. So I think that your future spouse would love you to like to travel, to expand and to, and to enjoy luxury. I'm listening. Yes, your future spouse wants to become very rich and wants to share that with you. Would love you to be open to receive because I think your future spouse, please, uh, uh, please, this is a general reading, okay? <laughs> Before someone says something, something silly, sometimes I say information and I don't know, some people take it like in defensive mode. This is a general reading. This is a provider, okay? Please before somebody jumps no i don't want anyone to provide for me then don't then go out, don't go out with a person like this you know sorry <laughs> because some it's uh, majority of you guys you're very open but sometimes i read some comment <laughs> okay so we have the hangman on reverse okay so this is letting me know that this person is very dreamy many people think that think that sometimes the word is they're wasting their time I think that many people see your future spouse like this. You dream too much. You're not, you're not mature. You know, you have to do what you have to do. But no, they are again. They are like the next Elon Elon um, Musk. Yeah, I think that your person is a genius. 
I think that they're able to see what others cannot see and they can reach the heaven, you know, they can reach, they know, and they, I think that they're already making a lot of money, if I'm being sincere. The nine of wands and the judgment on reverse, yes. Again, many people judge your person, but they don't care. They don't care. They just, they're just very aware that they deserve an amazing life, um, amazing abundance, and, they, and that they deserve somebody like you. Hmm. So if you like to judge, they are not going to like that, okay? Because the judgment is on reverse. They don't like that. They don't like people that judge. Maybe the majority of you guys are not like that, but they don't like criticizing, judging, you know? People telling, telling your future spouse, you are 30, so you should already have one child and you, will, you should work for that company. Who says that? Your future spouse is like, who, wh where does he say that? Where? In which part of the matrix does, does he say that? Why do I have to do that? If I know my potential, if I know that I can be very rich and I know that I can meet the love of my life. You know, that, that's your future spouse. You know? Many people, again, think that your future spouse is too much in the head, too dreamy. Yes? But they know what they want. And they're patient to meet you and to manifest an incredible life. Because they want to share your life, that beautiful and incredible life with you. Does that make sense? I think that's wonderful. I am listening from spirit that they like the color orange. So we have freedom. What did I tell you? Your person is like this. I think that you're the unicorn, you know, very magical. You don't like to judge. Very beautiful. You are not understood by everyone understood by everyone and I think your person is the eagle you know the, I think that your person is going to look at you first and they're going to go like whoa this person is different you know and you're going to think of them this person is different I think this is important for both of you to be highly respected you know and to be seen okay and I'm watching the um, avatar scene which I love that scene I see you I see your soul I see your potential. I see who you are. Maybe the majority of people do not see it because they're, very, they're, they're a little bit mediocre or they're not awakened, but I see you, you know? This is the same vibe from both of you. The energy and expansion. Again, come in expansion like the three of wands. You see? I think that both of you guys, you're going to become a very powerful couple together. I think that even you have very strong psychic abilities, both of you. Even it could be that you're natural witchers, sorcerers, both of you. There's something mysterious about you guys. I think that you are the same. I think that you came here to expand the consciousness, to expand your abilities and to expand together. And with so many apples and the yellow bird, a, a canary in Spanish, um, you know that you can have everything that you desire. And there's nothing wrong about that. There's nothing wrong about wanting more. Why not? You know what I mean? Many people, I think that both of you, you have passed through the same experience. If that's the case, please, if you don't mind sharing in the comment section. Has that been the case that many people has been trying to cut your wings and to cut their wings? You know? And I'm listening from spirit enough. They are different. You know, I think that both of you, you're one of the chosen ones. Or if you believe in that, you are part of that group of 144,000 starsets that came here with a very specific mission and with very specific gifts. So whoever tries to put on you black magic or to, to move a, I don't know, a group of people to make you feel wrong, they get a lot, a lot of bad karma very quick. Is, it, is this happening? And we have TikTok. We have milk and honey and loyal heart you see so the clock has just started to move both of you you're just about to live the best part of your life the sweetest part of your life it has not been easy the journey but it has been completely worth it because a part of finding one another and being loyal and being faithful i mean for you guys being faithful is like breathing it's not oh my gosh i have to make <laughs> A big effort not to sleep with someone else at your back. I mean, sorry, guys. I see it's so ridiculous. 
if someone loves you, someone loves you. It's not going to do BS stuff, okay? I don't know. I, I, I see it like that. Do you see it like that too? There are no excuses. Oh, the alcohol. Oh, yes, the alcohol. <laughs> oh, that. Oh, sorry. No, no. This You guys, you are a different level, okay? This is like... I don't know. I, th I think that many people are still living in in a very survival relationship. You know, they're, they're vibrating for survival, in survival mode. You know, they are operating in survival mode and they cannot have a, this type of relationship. And you guys, you are different at all. So you must laugh when people tell you what to do, right? It's like, come on. Please, first awake. <laughs> and then you can talk to me. <laughs> Is that, is that your mindset? Please, come on. You have not even awakened and you're telling me how to live my life when you don't know who you are. You know, you look, look at that. Look at that transmutation, the phoenix. That's both of you. You are completely beautiful phoenixes that have gone through hell. Yes, that, that, that you have work, overcome. And again, sweetness with prosperity. What did I tell you before? that you ha you're coming from hell and right now you're like come on i know who i am you're not going to fool me i know what i deserve in love in money in life in relationships and whoever is not going to give me the what's for me the basic bye okay I, I, okay i'm nice with you but bye. yes next 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 <laughs> we must me do you remember guys the mtv show next that's you next okay bye yes <laughs> okay bye next yes Okay, <laughs> and, we have, and we have this spirit, prosperity, and daffled fairy, new beginnings. You see, so both of you guys, you're ready for this connection. You're going to be very wealthy. I think that part of the reason that you want to become so wealthy is because you want to use that money wisely to help others, you know? Maybe you want to organize something to help children, maybe to help people that do not, that are willing to be adopted. I see a lot of adoptions on children over here. Maybe some of you, you want to help planet Earth, animals, you know, maybe mm, moms or dads or people that are suffering in a war. I see both of you guys becoming very rich and very powerful couple together, very awakened. And you, not only you're going to create more and more wealth, but you're going to help many people. You're going to teach them how to create wealth. And this is something very interesting that I, that I, I received this message from, an, from a YouTuber that I follow and she said this Is it better that you give, for example, $100 someone that is um, suffering, you know, economically? Or is it better that you teach them how to create money so they are not, they will not live the rest of their lives in that survival mode or in a victim mode, you know? Yes, that's a quick money and yes, it's going to help them for a moment but they will come back again to the problem with finances. So I think that both of you, you have this incredible expanded vision of how can we truly help? Not, we will not reach just point A. You want to reach point B, C, D, E, and F, you know? I think both of you guys, you're very, you are more intelligent than the media of people. You're awakened. I see like a partner of, of masters. So good for you. <laughs> I admire you guys. Luck is on your side, yes. And you see here, move on. Someone is unavailable, a waste of time, it's over. What did I tell you? Both of you guys, you're like, next, next. You know, it's like you're not wasting your time in people that are not, you know, that, that it, none of both of you, you're wasting your time in people that it's not the other one, you know? You know, I don't know if you have been watching Ladybugs, but yes, luck is on your side. Very soon, if you have not met this person, you will, guys, you will meet. And not only that, you're going to have a lot of fun in this relationship, in this marriage, but wow, the incredible things that you're going to do in this reincarnation. And I really, I want to thank you previously for who you are, you and your future spouse, and for, for, the amazing job that you're going to do and you I'm sure that you're already doing individually it's one of you so thank you so much my angels I hope you have liked it if that's the case of course like subscribing I am doing daily readings and my angels I have another 
another two tarot channels in Spanish, Crece tu alma tarot and Crece tu amor tarot, just in case you're interested, if you understand Spanish. And mind you, if you want to, no obligation, if you want to give me a donation, I rather prefer you use Keen or, or Purple Garden because I receive a compensation from those platforms and you receive more specific details, maybe timing, they're very good at that. Keen and Purple Garden down below. Thank you so much if you're going to proceed. And if you want to instead a private reading from me or, or a session on Cam where I will be telling in front of you and using Tarot, you can do it through my shop. My loves, I really admire both of you. Mm, big kiss, my angels. Thank you for being here. Thank you for existing. Welcome, group Hi. number three. So let's see what your future spouse would love you to have or to be like. Okay, so very beautiful. The pink. So... I think that your person is very, very sensitive, very sensitive. I think that they have the tendency of getting emotionally easily. Okay. And maybe I'm talking about you as well. And we have number 15. This is so crazy. <laughs> okay. I talk about this in group number one and two. In group number one, I think the, there's something going on with number six, with June. There's something going on with the month of June for all of you guys. For all of the groups. Because if we sum up 5 plus 1, it's 6. And in group number 1, I did not notice inside of the deck of the tarot, I had three cards from another reading. I think it was from the previous one. And one of the and one of the cards say, said June. And in group number 2, it's number 6, which I did not do it on purpose. <laughs> it's so funny how spirit works. And in here, I did not do it on purpose either. I did not realize 5 plus 1. I mean, I did not look at it. I know that 5 plus 1 is 6, of course. Okay, so there's something going on with you, okay? <laughs> Ooh, woo! Oh, sorry, am I doing it okay? Ooh, wow! <laughs> Ooh! Oh, yes, yeah, sorry, I'm not saying, I'm not doing it correctly. My voice is heard in the world, okay? So, I think that your person is expecting to find you as soon as possible because they're feeling a little bit alone, okay? So, they, they, it's funny because I'm listening more from their side. They don't want to be codependent of you, but it is true that they're feeling alone without you, okay? Maybe your future spouse would love you to be very independent or at least a little bit independent and not codependent of your future spouse. But I think that they're struggling with that as well. The, I don't know if you have been dealing with codependency issues in the past and that's something that you have been working on. There's something going on with the wolf when I was saying, uh, I was doing that silly, ooh, yes. So there's something going on with the voice. Yes, my voice is, is heard in the world. Your person would love you to be able to listen to them. So maybe they are coming from a past where people did not listen to them or they made them feel small. Okay, maybe they made them feel little, that, they, that their voice was not important. Maybe this is coming from their mom, their dad, other people. Okay, so yes, it's important for them that they feel safe with you and that they feel they can talk to you about anything and you will listen. It's not, have you noticed, guys, so many people, so many people that they give the appearance that they care for you, they are listening to you, but whenever you try to tell them something, they interrupt you constantly. Or they keep talking so much, you can merely introduce any word into the conversation. They hate that because they have lived a lot of that. People very selfish, not listening to them. I think with the voice, maybe some of them, they want to be, or they are motivational speakers, or they're singers, or they're actors, actresses, maybe they're working in the entertainment industry. It could be that there are celebrities, some of them, I'm not sensing all of them, but it could be that some of them, they're a celebrity, or they're going to become a celebrity or an influencer, an important influencer for the generation. Five of Cups. King of Swords, the High Priestess, Reverse, you know, your person is very psychic, and people made them feel wrong about it, okay, like a weirdo, I don't know if your person is a natural medium, I think that they're very, me they're, there's a lot of mediumship over there, 
I'm not saying they're not psychic, but they're a very sensitive medium. So we have the Five of Cups, we have the Page of Pentacles, King of Swords, Eight of Pentacles, the High Priestess on Reverse, and the Ace of Cups on Reverse. So they don't want you to, to judge them because of how good are they with, or how sensitive they are with their psychic abilities. You, they don't want you to judge them because I am listening with the soft cups on reverse that there's somebody in the family that has they're struggling with depression there's something going on with them I don't know it's not them maybe in the past they had depressions but or depression but I feel it's a woman it could be a sister even it could be a daughter because some of you are divorced it could be a mother that struggled a lot with depressions, with something going on with their emotions. And when they tell this to some people, they make these awkward faces that they cannot stand. So yes, they want you to be very open, you know, and very supportive. And again, I'm listening mental issues, mental health. Okay, maybe this is something that you have been struggling to. And maybe other partners in the past did not listen to you or did not understand you, were not empathic with you. That's the word. Yes, thank you, Spirit. So your person is waiting for you to be very empathic. We have the chariot and the imperial, yes. And your future spouse is waiting for you to be a team with them, okay? Because if these two horses are not in balance and, and are not going in the same direction, and there's not a good leadership over here, you know, taking like very healthy and positive action from both of them and listening to, the, to God, to universe. Maybe some of them, they believe in God, others in universe. I think that it's important for them that you believe in something. If it's not God, universe, you know, in energy, in something. I don't think they would feel comfortable if you're very close to spirituality or to religion or... There's something going on over there. And they would love you. Yes, they would love. They, they, they really want to travel with you to many places. I think that some of them, they're trying to create their own business out of their abilities, but still they're not winning a lot of money. They're winning money, but still not too much okay they have to depend on another job and maybe you're going to come to their lives maybe i'm talking about some of you that both of you you're working here in youtube you have started your tarot channel or your healing channel or maybe a, a channel completely different and you're you're still struggling a little bit yes you're winning money but you want to earn more money i think that it could be for some in some cases that both of you your creators here in youtube or any different platform or you have your own business both of you but you're still not there. But I think that both of you guys, you will work it out. You will be very supportive to one another and things will escalate, you know? Things will flow better, the money, when you guys are, you're, when you're going to be together. There's a thing about organization. I think that your person will love you to be organized or at least clean at home. I don't know if that's important for you. We have the four of wands, okay? So for them, it's very important, marriage. We have the sun, again, coming summertime. And the lovers, yes. So your person is would love to have a great connection mentally, spiritually, energetically, you know, from soul to soul and sexually. And very important that both of you guys, you want to marry. This is very important for them. I think that they met other partners that they did not want to marry. They did not believe in marriage, but this is not the case. Okay. Does it make sense? And we have an expected connection and reaching out. So beautiful. So opposites attract. Yes. I think, I, and again, like the chariot, right? So... Your person would love you to not be from their country. I don't know why. Maybe they, ha they associate their experiences with dating in their country or from the culture. Like, I don't know, they have a bad sensation. So they expect you from, yes, being from a different culture, country. At least they would love that. 
that you're foreign and reaching out yes um, expect a call text from your person of interest and they will love you to I mean they're going to contact you many times but they would love to see you as well with the card and the and the emperor they would love you to sometimes at least sometimes maybe they're not used to that sometimes to text them before they do okay so they want to see yes they're going to show you a lot of love but they want to see that in you as well okay they need that <laughs> I'm listening. That's beautiful. So they want to see that you're making an effort as well, communication. So we have here divorce, experiencing a breakup. So many of them, all of them, they have gone through a very tough divorce. Or maybe if it's not a divorce, maybe this means that they have gone through a very long, 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 long relationship that ended up and they don't want that to happen again. Okay. If some of you, you're divorced as well, don't worry, they would love to marry again. I'm listening. And we have gambling problems with addiction or gambling, bad finances. Maybe this is something coming from the past, okay? Maybe. Or maybe they went out with people that they had this issue, they had a lot of addictions and they're a little bit worried that you have the same issue. In the, in the past, a lot of liars, okay, and they don't want that. And confession you see someone has to tell you something so they want you to to be very sincere okay they want they would love you to not think that marriage is not possible you know I think that your person is very romantic <laughs> he's going to idea idealize you a lot yes Look at the back. Maybe some of you guys you're going to meet in a moment that there's a Mercury retrograde. Electronic uses, communication issues, review everything. You see, so maybe some of you you're going to meet in a moment where you buy a car or maybe they are going to buy you a car as a gift. But there's something going on with moving. We see here the chariot. So maybe even it could be that some of you you're going to meet on holidays, okay, during a trip. It could be. But yes, they, for them, it's very important that you really communicate them whatever you need, whatever you want. Even if you're angry, you communicate with them. Because I think that they're used to people getting angry at them and leaving, you know, leaving the home suddenly, no communication. Or maybe an ex being mad at your future spouse in the past and maybe not talking to them in one week. They cannot stand that. They don't want that. Okay, I don't know if that's the case for you as well. And pregnancy, someone is expecting. So for some of them, they're divorced and have children. Okay, they would love you to accept their teenage boy, girl. Okay. And some of them, if they are, they don't have children, they would love to have children with you. And the next card, I love it. We have commitment. Okay, things are getting serious. Yes, they, they would love to have children with you and they would, they would love to marry you. My angels. What a beautiful energy. I love you guys so much. If you have liked the reading, of course, thank you for supporting this channel, for supporting me with my soul purpose, subscribing, giving a like, giving a comment always helps, of course, for this channel to grow. And if you want a service from me, you have my shop down below. And if you want something more economical and more specific details, you have key and people got in the below. Big hug, my angels. I love you guys so much. See you tomorrow. Bye.